Hello guys, in this video I will show you how to set up a Pi wallet. First, let's go to mindpi.com website. We are on the Pi Network official website. Let's tap on Download Pi app now. Here choose if you want to download from Google Play or App Store. You will be redirected to download and install Pi Network app. The process is same as with any other mobile app. After you have done it, let's open the app. Here just choose which option you want to log in with for this app. I will go with a phone number and complete the next required steps. In the next step, we need to put our email address in these two boxes. Here we need to type a password for this app. In this step, we need to put our first and last name plus username we want to have. In this step, put the invite code. If you don't have one, put Don Biggie Don. Okay, now just go through these steps you see on your screen. Once you are done, the Pi Network app is ready. Let's go with another step. Click on your Pi balance on the top of the screen. Here tap View Checklist. Let's complete the first one, meaning we need to download the Pi Browser app. As you can see, the process is straightforward just like with every other mobile app. Once installed, let's open Pi Browser app. Okay, let's finally create our Pi wallet. Here tap to generate a new wallet. In this step, you will see the seed phrase of your wallet. Remember to not share it with anyone, as it is a direct access to funds in your wallet. After you are ready, enable Touch ID. Here you can choose if your wallet address will be searchable or not. I will go with the second option. Okay, now let's go back to Pi Network app. Tap on your Pi Coin balance and then on View Checklist. Let's confirm the third step. Here paste your wallet seed phrase from previous steps and confirm it. Now we need to confirm it by clicking a link in a mail from Pi. And we have done it. Now, let's go back to the checklist page. Let's complete another step. Here, choose the lockup percentage and duration you want. And tap Commit. OK, back to the checklist and let's go with another step. Go down till the end of this document and tap I accept. Here, put again your wallet seed phrase and tap Sign. Now, let's complete another step, which is a KYC verification. We are redirected to Pi Browser. Here log in in the same way you have registered before on the Pi Network. And enter your password. Okay, so we are back in the Pi Browser. Keep in mind that you might need to open the app again from your screen. Let's tap on Wallet and unlock it. Here we need to complete the KYC process. As you can see on my screen, I have only the second option available. So I will go with the banks of steps and buy some pie with this option, so my wallet will be verified. This and next steps you will need to do on your own. You will need to provide your identity details and buy some pie coins. After your payment on banks is completed, you should refresh your wallet and you will see the updated balance of your pie coins. And now you have a pie wallet that you can use. By the way, if you want to trade on Hyperliquid with discount on fees, check link in the description. So, that's the end of this video. Now, if you have found the content helpful, don't forget to give a like and subscribe to our channel for more content like this.